Hi there, I'm Lonnie with Untitled Nerd Network, and I want to address something very near and dear to my heart, and that is the fact that a lot of your uh, groups, both online and in person, having to do with nerdum, having to do with gaming, having to do with costuming, uh, make it very hard for new members to take part and feel accepted. And I think that's something that really needs to be addressed. Uh, case in point, I don't want to go naming anything in any particular groups because for obvious reasons, I just don't feel like calling anybody out today. Um, I feel like this is something that can be fixed. Um, but we were uh, in one of the local Pokemon Go groups over uh, the weekend and we were in the uh, Hickson area and we got on and we found a um, Mewtwo raid. Now, if you don't understand Pokemon Go, this probably isn't the rant for you, but we found a Mewtwo raid that nobody else knew about. We got on the messaging app and said, hey, we found this Mewtwo. Uh, who wants to show up and help us get it? And so probably a dozen people popped up. Yeah, yeah, you know, we could be there. It started at five o'clock. Said, okay, you know, we'll try to be there by five. Everybody will get together at five and then we'll go for it. So this was just a little bit after four o'clock. So we went to one of the local thrift stores that was within sight of the actual Mewtwo raid. And we killed an hour there. Well, right when the hour came up, we got on the app and said, hey, you know, we're almost there. A lot of people had already shown up at the raid, but we got on the app and said, hey, you know, we're almost there. Well, they got on replied and they said, oh, no, we're going in right now for the Mewtwo raid. We got some people here who can't wait any longer. And I'm thinking we were the ones who found the raid. I mean, granted, we're new to the group. We, you may not know us, but we're the ones who pointed the raid out. It's not like we're going anywhere. You know, we were there an hour ago. We're still here. We'll be there in five. Can you not wait five minutes? But no, apparently not. And that is a big problem, I believe, with a lot of your gaming groups, a lot of your local groups. And this isn't like pointing out at anyone in particular, but I've seen it. I've seen it. Costuming groups, things like that, where you are, you know, you send an inclusive message. You send a message out to everyone saying, hey, come, come join our group. Come be a part of our group. Come be friends with people, come communicate, come associate with everybody in the group, and uh, you'll be accepted. Acceptance is the big thing. And then you get there, you sit down at a table, maybe one person says hi to you, and there is, you know, this group of half a dozen people over here, half a dozen people over here, who, uh, and I mean, it, it kind of comes with the nerd community, because if there's one thing us nerds are, as uh, introverts, and we don't really do really good job of, um, like, getting to know other people easily. And uh, so when you have somebody like that who shows up at a group of people like that, you know, it, it's difficult in a way. But, I mean, the, the nerd community, it's like if you're going to have a group, if you're going to have, like, you know, a community of people we need to do a little bit better job of being inclusive to new members and making them feel wanted. But that's just the big thing on my mind this morning. I'm Lonnie with Untitled Nerd Network. Thanks for watching.